stand, but oh my. Play with the John. Play with the John Smoltz. I don't know who's going to stand. I'd love to say that. You came out with Smoltz and then, did you hear Marty V? Look at the North Tibbs cap. I know, Marty V was on fire. He only tipped his cap because he knew he beat it. Yeah, right. He overturned it. Don't worry, he wasn't safe for long. Oh, you know what? And what an unbelievable. Listen, great throw by Ross. Watch his pick by Baez. Pick and tag while he's in the air. This kid's a sick athlete. How great of an athlete is Javi Baez? Sick. That's the case. It is. Let's see. Watch his right hand. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watermelon, watermelon. That's watermelon. That's delicious. He caught it. Great hands. This kid, he knows his star right now. He knows it. Who's going to play him in the Javi Baez movie? <laughs> Matt Moore is hitting. And Matt Moore driving in a run. On an 0-2 pitch, base is juiced, and you're sitting there going, okay, this is the Gigantes. Charlie Correa. Oh, pitch game five. Two pitch game five against John Lester. Especially when... Stuff like this happens. Beating it out at first base, another run scores. That ends up slipping right here on the base instead of getting there, he slips. He's going to get a lot of flack on the fly home, on the flight home, oh, for that slip right there. Really? <laughs> Guys will be burying him. It's 3 2. Brandon Crawford comes as close as you can to hitting a two run. Yeah, I'd say with an inch or two. It's off the top of the wall, kicks. What a huge break for the Cubs right there. And don't quite understand why Hunter Pence, who was on first base, didn't score on this play because this is a ball that hit. there's no way in the world you're catching this ball in right field. How do you play right field? You're familiar with how this works. One would think, unless he thought Jay Hay could really get up. <laughs> that was he is known for his great defensive prowess. Uh, Connor Gillespie, the legend of Connor Gillespie in the postseason, continues. Just and this was the other reason hits. why I thought San Fran might go on to this one. Because even though Hunter erred in the base running on that ball, they end up driving him in, so it didn't really matter. 5 to the score. Theo looks nervous. He is. Brandon Crawford. Weird. Going to the eighth. Matt Moore in cruise control. Sean, they couldn't do anything with him. He had it working all night long. He had three pitch mix working, spotting his fastball, had the good curveball working, and the changeup. He had that place rocking out there in San Fran tonight. Eight innings, two hits, two runs. That's his 10th strikeout. 120 pitches for Matt Moore. He can't go back out for a night. This is far too much. Far too much. So we do the night. Derek Law starts it off with a ground ball to short. I'm surprised. Derek Law has pitched really well. I'm surprised that Boach didn't stick with him for a little bit. You know, one hit, they're still up three runs. It was a ground ball to short. The shift is the reason to me. It, it, it was. Javi Lopez walks huge. So and that is a that. huge at bat yeah. simply because now you put the tying run up at home plate. Yeah. But it's the closer, right? Sergio Romo. It's a slider to Ben Zobrist. And that's center cut right there. Three one. Zobrist does what he was supposed to do, and that's rocket one into the corner. And now, now these guys are fired up. How about this? Chris Coughlin to pinch hit for Addison Russell. So Bochy counters. He brings in Will Smith. Then Madden goes with Wilson Contreras to face Smith. Chess match. Guess who wins? Madden. Madden. Because he, he pressed the button and turned the ball. There comes two guys in. Die ball game. It's incredible. Look at wow. Contreras. What an impressive young player he is. Uh, next batter, Jason Hayward. And he's bunting. It's not exactly a great bunt. No, it's fun. But when he left the batter's box, he said, I got to get there because this is not a good bunt. He gets to second on the second air from Crawford. Hunter Strickland would come into the ball game. Trying to keep that go-ahead run at the Fires singles back. ninth inning for the Chicago Cubs and of course it's Javi Baez right in the middle of it right in the middle of it got an 0-2 pitch too right there so the Giants really couldn't find the answer in the ninth guess what the Cubs had theirs ready and locked in that's his second strikeout anyone want to see a third I know two guys that do not him nope he's not one of them <laughs> Boom. Oh, man. How bad did Chapman want that ball tonight? After last night, he wanted the ball. He said, no one's touching me tonight. You know, Chapman's throwing harder, 105 and all those things. He threw 102 today. Mm -hmm. A lot of hundreds that we saw. Almost every one of them was very well located. 
and it, they were just straight lasers out of his hand. Point A to point B, his hand to the glove, no, no contact. Uh, the comeback of the postseason in 2016, to talk about it, Chris Bryant was with our own Lauren Shahadi. Chris, the ninth inning, you won't soon forget. You started that whole rally. Take me through that at bat. Just try and get on base. I mean, I trust everyone on this team, everyone behind me, and, uh, you know, it really showed there. I mean, this team is unbelievable. I've never seen anything like this. We never quit, and uh, never a doubt. I mean, that was just uh, the best best game I've been a part of. Joe Madden stresses be present, not perfect. How have you done that this series? I mean, we've got tons of adversity on our offensive side. I mean, we haven't really been swinging it well, and all it takes is one inning, really. And that, that ninth inning there is some of the best uh, at bats you'll see, and we just like we we'll hope to carry that into the um, the NLCS. Coming into the season with huge expectations, World Series favorites. What's it like to get one under your belt? It's great. I mean, it's just a box we we, we just checked off. I mean, there's still a long way to go, but. Um, uh, we feel great. It, 